Now, as we've seen in previous videos, the log of an exponential, the log of this exponential versus t, or the log of the population versus t, in the case of exponential growth, is a straight line. Okay? So the graph would look like this. If this graph looks like this, the graph of the exponential looks like this. It'll be tangent to this graph. It's an initial point. This graph will start slacking off and move away from this. And if you look at these graphs, and I, I'm not sure who the source of the graphs is, but I've checked their numbers against everybody else's. It's some statistical group. Uh, I don't think they're partisan. And the facts aren't partisan. The facts are what they are. Um, you see this versus this. This line, I think it's a dotted line on the graphs, represents what would happen with unrestricted growth. And of course, this applies to any population model. Okay, here's unrestricted growth on the log or, uh, plot. And here is a graph that shows you how the slopes keep changing. The unrestricted growth has a constant slope on the log graph for reasons that we've seen. If you keep changing the growth rate, the slope of this graph changes. The slope of the blue graph will change accordingly.